Who's there? And here? Why would you go up there alone? I'm hoping. And here? You spectres have seen Antea, have you? You're the boss and all, you could have included me. You see, we never stood a chance. Antea, you hot? Where are you? I'm here, my love. What happened? Yourself. God came to the man in a dream and said, Behold, thou art dead. But the man had done nothing wrong and said, Lord, wilt thou also slay the righteous? Where's Antea? What have you done with her? That was Paul's. Lady, if you hurt her... You cling to love, a fool to the last. There is no love. There is only defilement. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Who will suffer like I 
If you laid a finger on her... You know what? Come to her aid. Oh, there is no aid. There is oh, only... Oh, retribution. Give him back. How touching. You come to claim your man. You think you love him. You do not. There, in the dark of your manner, there is no love. Only betrayal. I offer you a trade. He stays and you leave with your life. I'll bargain with no ghost. You have a brain, yet you think with your idiot heart. You're weak. to her aid now when all is lost. If you do, I'll be waiting. The icy ocean made a diamond from his grief, then buried it in his heart. The weight of his failure dragged him down. Outside time, drowning in the gloom, he spoke her name. Take me instead, he screamed, soundless, to the cold and silent waters. Out beyond the black veil of death, something heard his cries and reached for him. Let her go. Take me instead. Let her go! Ah, you're awake. Who are you? She who rescued you. Tended you for days on end. Weeks, maybe. Weeks? Oh, God. What have I done? Get your strength back before you beat yourself up. She's dead. Yes. That's why you're here. And why I was sent to look after you. Who are you? I feel like we've met, but... 
I'm sure we have not. I feel like I know you forever. But do I? You're confused. It's normal. You've been near killed by a nightmare, you've lost your beloved, and now you've a witch by your sickbed. Witch? Witch. I go by Seeker. Find the Banisher, said my mistress. Tend him and answer any questions he asks you before you leave him be. So, how do you feel? Does it matter? Of course it matters. It means you're alive and you haven't given up. Who sent you? Her name is Ceridian, and my hands and words are hers. Beyond that, don't burden yourself. Sir Hadin, this little seeker who asked you to find me, is she Scots or something? It's Sir Ridian. She's too old to be from anywhere in particular, and while, yes, I found you, she told me where to look. This nightmare, how it spoke, how it tore right through her. Never seen the like of it. Few have. Fewer have lived to tell of it. What drew such a powerful spirit here? Who knows? Something awful, I don't doubt. The worst angers rise from the most terrible wrongs. My friend said that. He's trying to warn us. An immutable law. You have wise friends. What am I to do now? How do I? How do I do it alone? You're not alone. Have faith. If Ceridian had told me more, I'd tell you it. But you must have faith. <laughs> have faith. You say that you do not know me. Easy said, harder done. What comes easy in life tends not to matter. It's the hard stuff that counts. You've a hole in you, a yawning, grimacing pit in your soul. That's love, that is. The hole won't fill because the love won't die. God, what have I done? Here's the thing. Unlike most, you get a second chance. I suggest you seize it. Why do you aid me? I serve my mistress. She bids me help you, so I help you. Ceridian says the wall between the living and the dead is under threat. You, it seems, have a part to play. This is mine. You've lost me. No, I found you. But so did your grief. And it demands to be felt. You may think you're done with your ghosts, Red McCraith. But they aren't done with you. I'll go now. Rest. Why ever my mistress saved you, she has good reasons. The best. Where are you going? Home. To Ceridian. She needs me. Where shall I find you if... or when I need to? Maya marshes. Great big swamps other side of the woods. You can't miss them. We'll know when you're coming. Till we meet again, then. That's right, Banisher. Now, turn around. What? I'm leaving.
I don't know what this is, but I'm staying away from it. Where am I? Damn it. What am I doing here? No, it's not the time. But they living so here.
what is happening? What? And here? This isn't happening. This can't be happening. Antea, call me to you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry! I'm here! Lead me to you! Right here, my love, right here. It is you. You. you have me. Oh. No, don't go. I'm here. Follow me. Where are you going? Over here. I have you. I'm right here. Where are you? 
Where have you gone? Antea! troubled. How could I not be? To have lost you and found you like this. And you're hungry. That's one way to say it. Yes. What can I do? his Bible, the tie that bound his ghost. Some essence remains upon it. For now, it will do me. you're here. I'm glad you're back. Truly. The living should not truck with the dead. I've known that since childhood. I learned the hard way. You never told me this. What happened? It was a lifetime ago. For now, it doesn't matter. How are you feeling? Awful. And with a few more words? Angry, frustrated, useless. We should talk about what happened. After the meeting house, I mean. What do you remember from after you died? I remember the suddenness of my death. I remember nothing but. After that, a nothingness. Timeless. Lost. And then I heard you. You spoke my name. I searched for a way back. I woke up in a cave. Been rescued by a young woman named Seeker. A witch's apprentice. She was proud to tell me that. Her mistress had sent her to take care of me. Witches rarely show themselves. Intriguing that one would help us. I think we should go back to New Eden Town. I agree. To free me, I believe we must reclaim my body. I refuse to be this way. I'll not abide it. I'm so sorry, my love. How can I help? 
I'm a ghost. You're a banisher. I'll not banish you. I cannot and tear. So you die. You can't ask that of me. If that's what I wanted, you'd have no choice. But you don't wish it, do you? Not before I've had my revenge. Not before I've seen the nightmare defeated by you and me both. In the schoolhouse, he joked about bringing me back to life. Is that possible? Yes. The ritual of lesser palingenesis. It's extremely difficult. Highly dangerous. I could try, right? You'd teach me and I'd bring you back. Red, it's an ancient ritual. It requires power. It consumes essence in large quantities. We're talking about human sacrifice. Murder. Just maybe we could consider it. I mean, if there's the slightest chance I could bring you back, I'd take it. It's a dark ritual, Red. It's tempting, and that's dangerous. To think of being back in your arms. I'm tempted to. Could I give you your assent? That would be the simplest solution, but not the easiest. Why? My body is my tie, and the nightmare still holds it. In the meeting house, but before she let me fall, I swear she dared me to come back. She's as devious as she is powerful. She won't just hand it over. Then what shall we do? If we are to return to New Eden Town, we must first learn more about our enemy. Charles said nightmares don't appear without good reason. Yes. We have a mystery to solve. Witches to meet. People to find and questions to ask. And then you'll help me go. One way or another. I will. I swear it, Mother. Rest. You need it. I'll stay close.
On to New Eden, whichever way it lies. We'll need provisions, going for the basics. We'll manage, together. What the hell happened here? Took him. Can you not see the symbols on the wall? No. Take my hand. I want to try something. Whoa. Is that possible through our bane rings? They allow us to connect the invisible and the incarnate through this bond. What I see, I bestow on you. Are those webs made of spectral stains? Let me. All these years, the things we must have missed. The dead hide more from the living than we thought. This is going to be helpful. Demonologists and their shabby rituals. Something's nearby. Where is it? We can fight them together. Wasn't much use. You were, I promise. You'll get better. Things will get better. Did you feel that? It's close.
to work, Banisher. Yes, something's here. They always end up mucking around with black magic. Always. That spectre, it's heading for that corpse.
Sit down. Watch out. Spectre possession. It's not just New Eden Town. What happened here for the veil to be so thin? War, invasion, or colonization of a land that's vulnerable to haunting. Like a bit of rabbit, but these are off. That'll be why the wolves haven't eaten them. I like a bit of rabbit, but these are off. That'll be why the wolves haven't eaten them. Hunting gear. Perhaps our trappers are nearby. You took yourself up there very fast. That might take some getting used to, for both of us. to tell I'm haunted. Perhaps. If they had talent or training. What if someone sees you? Unlikely. If they had talent or training, they wouldn't have needed us banishers. something spectral nearby. I wonder what happened to the trappers around here? The woods are swarmed with spectres. Hopefully they left. These witches you mentioned must know something about the nightmare. Aye, but can we trust them? Well, witches only involve themselves with people if they absolutely have to. Yours must have good reason.
I think I see a crossing over there. Signs of civilization. Lucky me. Nice place. Wolves and spectres aside. Don't you have wolves and spectres in the highlands? Aye, but ours have the courtesy of letting me catch my breath between fights. Creeping ivy. I always hated these sap thirsty spectres. Bad news. The bridge is out. We'll find another road to New Eden. Strange. I see stains, but not the usual kind. There's a pattern to them. Don't you see it? It calls to me. Over here. I have strong ankles, but at this height, we're gonna make it. I have strong ankles, but at this height, we're gonna make it. I have strong ankles, but at this height, we're gonna make it. Go. Those stains. I could have grasped at them had I been stronger. It's hard to think clearly. The hunger is back and it's growing fast. Already? Right, let's find something to sustain you.
There's someone inside. Someone tainted. Ben, you're back. Beg pardon. Thought you were someone else. You hungry, friend? The stew is thin enough, but I'd be glad to share. Kind of you to offer, lad, but no, thank you. Been a while since I've seen another human's face. You come from camp? You a hunter? Of sorts. Red McCraith. I'm a banisher. Like in the stories. Jacob Lind. I'm a trapper. <laughs> That's a real job. You're exhausted. And surprising given how tainted are these woods. Are you sleeping? I don't like sleeping. I see things. Bright eyes in the leaves. What does tainted mean? Marked by ghosts. Haunted. Tell me of your nightmares. One nightmare. Always the same one. Ben has it too. Would you care to share them? No. No. It is a nightmare. Nothing more. What are you doing here? Had you nowhere safer? The woods are kind to them as knows them. We hunt here. When we get pelts and meat, we trade in New Eden. But game's been scarce. We've not to trade, so we wait. When even the wolves are starving, you know it's going to be a bad winter. Winter? This is June. Is it? Could have sworn it was... I'm sorry. On my own, I lose track of time. And with your friend? Oh. You met Ben, did you? He was just here, he was. Just here. 
Who's Ben? Another trapper? Hi, the best of them. Taught me all I know. He's out now, but he'll be back. Where has he gone? The bridge is down. As down as down can be. Can't cross. Bad things lurk in the shadows. They sent flesh. Game's low. Game's low and Ben's gone. He'll find game, he will. I know it. What lurks in the shadows? Is that what keeps you here? That... and the fog. Can't hunt if you can't see. Ben shoots better than me. Knows the woods better too. I'd only slow him. Only slow him. Where did you meet Ben? We found each other. Brothers in spirit, he said. He's been good to me. Too good. Why? He's important to you. I? And me to him. He's lost his nerve. Or a ghost has taken it from him. Get some rest, Jacob. You need it. If you see Ben, tell him I'm thinking of him. Tall lad, even when he's lying down. Can't miss him. Poor child. He's shrouded in spectral stains. Do you sleep here, Jacob? Ben sleeps here. I don't sleep. <gasps> there are maggots in the bed. Your meat's turning, friend. Food is scarce. We might do. Whatever haunts the boy spawns maggots. We should talk to this Ben fellow. Ben's things. Most of them. Not the rope. You can have it if you want. Kind of you. Thank you. Ben went out without a gun. We're trappers, not hunters. We had the gun for safety, but it got damp. Done work. Ben went out without a gun. We're trappers, not hunters. We had the gun for safety, but it got damp. Done work. He's so confused, I doubt he knows what year it is. What happened to him? Maybe his mate abandoned him. Quick mist, spun by a ghost after a violent death. Anna sure row number eight. Don't get lost in quick mist, lest the spectres get you. Wise, but I see no other way. Either Ben was lost in the mist, or he's the source of it.
Oh, this quick mist is thicker than a Scots Dragoon. It smells almost as bad. I see fine. Wait. That's, that's better. And a little terrifying. Do you see that? It looks like the fog is coming from those odd-looking stalagmites. Hold on. I think I can rid us of the quick mist. Oh. Well, I'm partly made of the same stuff. Find what caused it. You mean, let's find out who died. Traces of a struggle. An echo hangs on it. Shaw in Drast, the Toki Min Kurster. I can I can't do it no more. On your feet, Lind. We don't no. give up. I've had enough. No way up. There's no way down. For days we've eaten nothing but boiled shoe leather. I'm done. We don't give up. <laughs> Leave me be. God be damned. I'm sick of carrying you. What are you doing? Don't hurt me. Ben died in the fall. And now his maggoty ghost is back to haunt. The friend who pushed him. It's 
So is Jacob lying to hide the murder? He wouldn't be the first. We need to find the body, if the wolves haven't gotten there first. Feel something close. Shite on a short stick. Bloody hell. The man's been torn to pieces. No, wait. He's been carved with a knife. For his meat. Still no tie. Jacob's hovel, perhaps? Jacob was eating meat. Jacob was eating Ben. Was he really hungry enough to eat his friend? Maybe the nightmare had something to do with it.
Something's here. Hidden. You shouldn't stay in there. Devil take it!
Let's look for our tie while Jacob's outside. Who oh, there to you, Jacob? Mr. McCraith, sir? You were struggling yourself and Ben. Why'd you not leave? Leave? No, can't leave. This here is home. We trap here, we eat here, we tan pelt to leather here. Our lives are here. Can't leave. Did you not try the river? The fog had to lift some time, and if you stay, you'll starve. We have enough. Thanks to Ben. Ben wanted to leave. You argued. Remember? Ben's out and about right now. We don't argue, you know. One time, a storm caught us napping. Sidelong hailstones and everything. We was lost. But we found our way. Even then, Ben never said a word in anger. Even though I slowed him down. Has he lost his mind? Or is he tricking with us? I can't tell. Farewell to you, Mr. Lynn. Farewell, Mr. McCray, sir. Farewell. Poor lad. His food is the meat of the matter. And tell you, that's horrible. Never heard a worse pun. I like it. I think I found our tie. How did I not know? The before. There were so many spectral stains, it's a wonder we found it at all. Come on, let's talk to Ben. Call for the ghost. You're not Jacob. Who's you? My name is Red McCraith. The Scot. You? Antea Duarte. We're banishers. We can help you. I'm beyond help. Where's Jacob? You tried many times to leave this place. I tried and failed. Week on week, month on month, maybe. We went in circles. The woods are tricky, sir. Treacherous, mean. Round and round we went, round and round and back again. Jacob said you both had nightmares, the same nightmare. Aye, and yet we got no sleep. Couldn't tell truth from fantasy. The shadows seemed to flicker at the corners of our eyes. How long have you and Jacob been out here in the woods? Some winters now, but this one, it never ends. No way out, no way in. We were alone, not an animal in sight. No, when things changed, we got stuck. <laughs> These godforsaken woods. 
We know what befell you, Benedict. What keeps you here? He does. He waits and waits and waits on me. He'll not face what he has done, and I cannot go. I cannot go. But I'll not hate him. How could I? We thought him lost in mind and reason. Who would not lose their mind? Stuck in place for weeks on end, deprived of a living, deprived of a life. Though I denied it, I saw it coming. I became wary. Some part of me knew what he was thinking, because I was thinking it too. What do you want from Jacob? Do you seek revenge? I seek no vengeance. He is I, and I am him. What does he need that he may let go? He needs to face the truth, to accept what he has done to both of us. At night, he'd read scripture. God would mind us if we were good and honest. Jacob taught me that. We were good. We lived honest lives. We kept to ourselves, minded our business, and no one else's. So tell me, Banisher, what did we do to deserve this? This was not God's doing. Another powerful entity is at work here. New Eden is cursed. Then God has forsaken us, and we are doomed. Thank you, Benedict. Perhaps we'll talk again. Perhaps we shall, Banisher. Perhaps we shall. Jacob must confess. I fear the truth will break him. You're back. Thank you, Benedict. Perhaps we'll talk again. Perhaps we shall, Banisher. Perhaps we shall. Oh, there to you, Jacob. Mr. McCraith, sir? I'm sorry, Jacob, we must talk. Something has happened to Benedict. What? Where is he? What happened? Come on now, Jacob. If something's happened to Ben, say so. Where is he? Day after day, you walk hungry from your nightmares. You tried to escape and failed many times until you broke. You killed your friend, Jacob. What? No. No, that's not what happened. Leave me be. Aye. That's what you said to Benedict before you pushed him off the cliff. But that's not all, is it? You killed Benedict, then you ate him. You were starving to death, yes, but you made your choice. You're not real. You're not real. You're a monster. Benedict lingers. End his suffering. Face the truth. I failed him. I failed Benedict. 
I was so angry, so angry. He kept pushing me. We kept, we argued, and I couldn't think. When I saw him lying there on the ground, lifeless, the whisper said, it was him or me, him or me. I would have died. I should have died. For my sins, I deserve no better. I failed God. I failed my friend. I'm a monster. I deserve no mercy. No. You're just a sinner, begging for help. We both faced a choice, simple and awful, to kill or to die. You struck first, and here we are. Do you forgive me? Our fates are in the hands of others now. Yes. Banisher, do your job. If you're to come back, if we're to use the ritual we spoke of, this is when it starts. Red, if we take one step along that path... Jacob is ready to die. The others won't be. We'll tell lies. We'll harvest the essence of the living. I'll shoulder the blame. As the man says, we face a choice, simple and awful. Do we kill to be together again? Or do we part forever? We must decide now. Benedict Stoughton, you were betrayed, failed and defiled. You were bound to a world to which you no longer belong. You have no reason to stay. You are not welcomed, neither do you wish to be here. I did not want this. It was him or me. A curse on Jacob for what he did. Curse this damn fog too. Curse this forest. Curse it all. It's over, Jacob. Ben's gone for good. Thank you. I... Thank you. It's over. The tie will sustain me a little longer. Jacob, would you mind if I rest inside a while? Suit yourself. No more maggots. Ben is gone for good.
killed and ate his friend. When I was a soldier, I heard many stories of those besieged eating their own. Some were true. Famine is a ferocious master. Jacob was hungry. Yeah, just like you. Just like me. How do you feel? I feel trapped. Locked into an embrace with a nightmare. I crave. I crave essence. With it, I'd not so fast decay. With it, I'd not so quickly become one of those stupid bloody specters. We made the right choice. We made it together. Taking a life is no small matter. When I ascend, we'll be separated. For the rest of your life. Maybe for the rest of eternity. Never again shall we stand side by side. This we, this thing we have, shall cease to be. That settled. Thank you. I hope you've no regrets. For soon, you'll release me. I'll have my assent. I hardly want to let you go. I know, but you must. Okay. I am a shadow, caged and fading. You are still here? Still you. We could... Jacob Lind's essence called to me. I knew it wrong, but I desired it. There lies perdition for both of us. I cannot abide what I have become. I don't want to abandon you, but I must. So be it, my love. We'll reclaim your body. Now have your ascent. I swear it. <laughs> <laughs> 